Well, hello there, YouTube. Welcome to Tuesday, the 9th of April. It's kind of it rained all night, but it's uh, kind of peaceful now. Light breeze. Yard is becoming a jungle. Need to dry out so I can mow it. But thank you guys for uh, the nice comments on uh, yesterday's video. Read them this morning. And, uh, ooh, big old hawk flying across there. But, um, yeah, thanks for, uh, for being kind about that because I kind of spun myself up over that R90 and drug you guys right along with me. So, uh, a lot of you guys were very, very kind. I thought I would have a, a big disappointment for getting everybody all revved up, myself included. <clears throat> but I had to, <laughs> it's fitting because I had this crazy dream of having this massive, YouTube vlogger meetup. <laughs> it was crazy. That's that what I woke up cool. to this morning. That would be cool. It was wild. It's amazing how vivid and real your dreams can be. Oh, no kidding. <laughs> All right, Mama. Let's head roll. on south. All right. Ooh, Mama, it's windy out here today. <laughs> All right. Love. See you. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> and I got a bunch of bulletins. The uh, 758-50s from the factory, they may have folded the uh, air filter. There's a lip down there. I'll show you here in a second. This takes, like, no time to pull the filter out of this thing. And um, I'll show you what you're looking for. And I told them, officially, I'm not taking it. I am probably pretty much an idiot for not getting this thing, but oh well got to listen to that little inner voice sometimes anyway that's what's going on this morning so the filter let me turn the light on here the filter just slides down into that slot well if you're not careful when you're sliding down you can lip this and pull it up well if you pull it up it's not sealing anymore so like this one you can see it didn't get peeled up and you just very carefully slide it back down in the hole. It just goes in, goes in like a cassette. All right, so she's back down in there. And all you do basically is is uh, push this button, is the release button, and and uh, lift up at the same time. And it just slides out, like I say, like a cassette. All right, initial oil level is set. That one's done. She passed. R9T's got to go up, but this is what I come down to show you. Um, I think I need to wash my uh, <laughs> my HP. This is one that Kurt pulled out of the crate last night. Believe it or not, this is only our second GSA HP. But uh, other than missing a bunch of stuff, looks a lot better when they're clean than dirty. Huh? I should be ashamed, but. How, how mine looks is, is how they get when you're riding in the wintertime. It's just a price you pay. The nice thing is they clean up so easy. All right, this GTL is sold. I'm gonna, looks like my GTL oil change rolled in here. I have all them keys, yeah. Uh, the, uh, that red 750 needs the uh, seat latch replacement so that one's going to get left down and uh anyway i'm gonna take this thing for a quick spin and then i'm gonna try next obviously i'll have to do the oil change on the customer's gtl but i'm a oh i just seen his roof at the last second but um i'm gonna try to get my champagne dark edition um, Spider RT limited upstairs and I'll need to get the uh, Urban GS up there as well because the salesman said he goes I got that sucker sold he goes oh thanks for letting us know you're not taking it the sales manager wasn't there yesterday so I didn't I didn't bother telling him anyway he had some guy that was interested in it 
over the weekend that he'll let him let the gentleman know that for some reason I don't take it. Well, some reason is I ain't taking it. I still don't know why. I'm just not taking it. I'm gonna ride that thing upstairs and go, no, you're an idiot. I'll be downstairs calling the bank. But I might, this is gonna be a test ride day today. What do y'all think of that? Test ride and 758.50 GS bulletin info all right so this is gonna have a new home probably today the urban GS who knows I'm sure it's coming at some point but at that price that thing's gonna fly out of here anyway thanks for coming along for the GTL rip oh well, they're not done with the paperwork for the GTL so a little bit of gas in this thing and take it up front. Oh no. I love the rumble of these things. probably had her hopes all up she had a new home I'd have loved her for a long long time it's sad just can't think about it too much because I'll change my mind in a heartbeat be something cool coming up next who knows service I'll grab that when I come back through to go down there's no plate on this thing so I'm just gonna do my quick little parking lot little jaunt and she's done got spoiled because she's been riding some uh, non-ethanol super in her for almost two tanks things are fun just keep the original plan <laughs> I do love these things what am I doing better yet why am I not doing it whoa it's a little fast through here to a stack of cars. <laughs> should, should get back to thinking of the forerunners, huh? Oh, that's it right there. The darker gray one right there. Funny is I just 
don't know why I have a funky feeling about this. I just do. I just keep saying the bigger and better deal is coming on something. Man, oh man, are these things cool. With your little red seat and all. Aren't you just so cute? Alright. I'm gonna walk away. I'm gonna do the smart thing. I don't know why. Hmm. Alright. We're doing the right thing. Even you guys agree. His key fob is so weak. We'll go sell that boy a key fob battery. Watch, you'll even get a warning here. See it? That's what the triangle, it's a soft warning saying, you're about to get stranded. <laughs> you can get out without a battery. But it makes it uh, kind of fun to get the alarm off. He's got it set so that it defaults to, it sets itself within a few seconds of shutting the bike off. So it's gonna go off at some point. He's gonna run up to turn it off. She ain't gonna turn off because the old fobby fob fob. But you can, there's a place you can stick the fob and get it to uh, override it. The fob will work without a battery, in other words, but it has no range. So, since we went for our last little ride and I was doing the service on this thing, Typhoon Mary, she kind of passed by and let herself be known by soaking everything. You know, and then springtime storms, man, they are a doozy. They flat cut loose. <laughs> oh, it's red. I gotta stop. I gotta stop. Gotta be legal. Legal. Sh Spiegel. See, the guy's got the, almost called it my urban GS. See, that's, that's not good when you almost claimed ownership already. But the urban GS and that K1600, they got that thing out from up front quick. <laughs> they said the rains are coming. All right, thanks for coming along for another little rippity rip rip. All right. down here stealing my my spare spider parts got my little stash of stuff and mirror clips and stuff anyway this is the last ride of my of my old 2018 demo my beloved spider i really like this one she was a good one this one in my 2016 are the two that that really stand out to me of the spiders I had. In fact, I was going to buy that 2016. You guys remember that? So I just make it a quick little ride. Poor little spider. <laughs> My good old gal. Only got 1,100 miles on it. That's a crying cheek. we got on that Riker already it's it's funny when you really like it you put a lot of miles on it quick it's like that urban GS man I, I put more miles on that thing in seven days than than I have in the last five or six months on the GSA but in all fairness it lasted through the winter and speaking of the GS the urban GS it's sitting right there in the window well just back of the window but the uh, uh, one of you guys that watch I have no I have no way of finding out who you are because that 
would be considered privileged information, but maybe you'll come in and say hey or something. But, uh, anyway, uh, somebody that watches the vlogs, thank you very much, by the way. Whoever you are, the unnamed person. Um, wanted to get a GS because he seen me riding around having so much fun. So he decided he wanted an Urban GS and he found out I wasn't, a wasn't taking that one. So, uh, he's going to take it, as, as far as I know. Haven't, haven't heard otherwise. Oh, Ryan, you put the zip ties together. All I took when I took the thing home is uh, just a key. But one of these keys need to go in the packet. One goes with the sales guys. He may well wash the bugs off of it. But anyway, um, if you end up with that GS, whoever you are, um, give her some love, because I sure love that thing. Yeah, I probably should just buy it, but this will be the best thing. You buying it and having fun on it. Alright, that's it. I'm getting soaked. <laughs> Little woman? Just a hug. Oh, pretty wild Tuesday. It was. Oh, it was busier than a three-headed chicken. You poor thing. <laughs> you cut yourself too, I see. Yeah. Uh, actually, I did it with a pair of really old caliper snap ring pliers. Oh. I went to pick them up. They slipped out of my hand. And I... Did the, you know, grab them, they spun in the air. Oh, yeah, you grabbed the pointy end. Yeah, well, when they came down, I went to give her a good old grab and uh, poked myself. Oops. But anyway, let's head on north. All right. All righty. Well, hello there, you two. We almost waited too late to come out and do it outside. Yeah, it's almost dark. Yeah, it was right at sunset, but with all them clouds and stuff, it's dark quick out here. Yes, it Who's does. Who's pawing at me back? I think that's Annie. Yep. But um, we'll we'll get to the puppy here. <laughs> I've did all them rides today, and I've got a lot of time that I need to try to build a vlog out of. Riding that Urban GS, that that was a kind of a weird feeling. Thinking about that being like I'm gonna buy this thing to decide not to. So that was a it was a weird experience riding that thing. And I really think how much I really, really like it. But I don't know. Just got that feeling something bigger and better is coming along. I don't know what. It's just that weird, the little voice like you guys are all talking about. Yeah. You just never know. But anyway, I'll be okay with that. And the cool thing is, is someone that watches the vlogs, so I hear. I can't ask name or anything because of our privacy policy. But um, anyway, supposedly someone that watches the vlogs is going to come pick that one up. That would be cool. Yeah, that'd be way cool. I'll be in touch with it slightly. You yeah. Know? Maybe from afar, maybe just pictures, or maybe it'll come in for a service or something. That'd be kind of cool. You never know. But anyway, I want to save up time to uh, leave time for rides I did today. Seems like I was on motorcycles more than I was working on. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to roll out on you. Alrighty. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Wednesday or Thursday. Heck yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Yes. We'll talk to you tomorrow. You guys take care. <laughs> All right. Bye-bye now.